guys, it's me Brayden here, and today I'm going to be reviewing Chester's Flamin' Hot Fries from the company of Chester's. They are corn potato snacks, and I do not have a drink with me, so this is going to be the really intense challenge. So I'm going to open up the bag. They also smell hot. Okay, so I want to sit down, and there's a lot of fries. So I'm going to right now just pause the video for a second. Okay, so let's get started. It's not too hot. Not too hot. Oh, there's a hair on it. Gross. This one looks hotter. <clears throat> oh god. Like, it feels like the, it broke apart. And then it came to life and started punching my throat, which makes the spice kick in. It's not that bad right now. It's just... I feel like the devil moved hell into the back of my throat. Oh my Dumbo. Um MichaelCroworbs.com. I don't know what that means. Michael Crow Orbs. Well I do not know what I said yesterday. No, no, two days ago. Already. I'm gonna give a shout out to Morgs. I watch his videos every day. Durham Semolion. Clover Valley Albo Macaroni. Preheat oven to. No. Oh, here's how to make home style mac and cheese. Imagination! Preheat oven to 360 degrees. Cook Clover Valley Elba macaroni according to package and directions. Heat Clover Valley butter over medium heat in a large saucepan. Stir in Clover Valley salt, pepper, and flour and stir until smooth. Gradually whisk in milk. Bring to a boil and stirring constantly. Cook and stir cheddar cheese until cheese is melted. Drain Clover Valley. Wait. Cook and stir a couple minutes or until thickened. Reduce heat and stir three cups of whole sauce in a bowl. I'm going to do two at once. <laughs> I think it was a hot fart. I still have to do another full challenge later. Awkward as hell. <laughs> Sturum Semolina.
let's play pumpkin. MyColdWarms.com My grow orbs. My my crow grow orbs not come. I'm gonna do nineteen at lunch. It's a really smooth smoke. Pleasant. <laughs> I need a drink. So I just got me a red Gatorade. I'm going to pop it open. I need to pause the video again. So I got it open. <laughs> My butthole fell off. Oh, I just gave myself a wedgie. I don't even wear underwear. I need a blanket now. Why the hell? Who puts chili peppers in a jar of pickles? She. So if we're making freaking dill pickle Dorito chips, we're not putting these on them. They have freaking peppers in it. Who wants to have damn peppers in pickles? <laughs> I'm afraid so my brother was only like three years old. And my dad saw like five under rings down his throat. And he was like, Well, that's how much sticky pickle. Not even halfway through the damn bag yet, and it's already been eight minutes. This might be more than my first one, which was a terrible idea. This is even this is even a bigger bag. Uh, it was this fruit punch flavored Powerade. Mm. Mm. Uh. Creamy vodka bubble sauce. And by the way, it's only like, it's only 8, 11 in the morning. My mom is still asleep, my dad's still asleep, my brother's at his best friend's house. And I'm just sitting downstairs in my kitchen eating a full bag of flaming Hot French fries. There's a pigeon, 500 pigeons out my butthole. And if anyone calls me Brayden Brat with a B in the comments, I'm reporting your comment, and I will, um, I will tell YouTube that you keep on calling me on the wrong name. Cause it's Parat with a P. In kindergarten, I had two Braydens in my class, so everyone had to call me Brayden PP.
which is gay. Yeah. Because everyone thought it was an actual penis. We meet again, Mr. Evil French Fry. <laughs> Tasty. Yeah, I'm really like my brother. What the hell is wrong with my cat right now? I think Riley. I think Riley drank and he's really high now. Daddy, are you high? Mmm. This is Daddy. This is Jeffy. <laughs> this is the face that Jesse makes when um Mike attempts to steal his cow tails. <clears throat> and then here's what he looks like when he eats a flame and hot chip. I did it. I did that in my video when I was trying to shove one of those dynamite chips. I actually um, my mom said that she never suggests me to eat those kinds of rolled up hot chips. The the Topa Toast Demise Enrolados rolled up potato chips. <laughs> rolled up potato chippy. I'm gonna do four at once now. <laughs> oh, hey, help me. Johnny, I think your my thumbnail should be like this. <laughs> comment. I want you guys to comment what your favorite flame and hot chip is, and if you say this chip, I'll give you a shout out in my next three videos. But no fast break three eighty three. I know that every time Bat nineteen does a burning question episode. Fast break 383. It's just a. Never mind, I'm not gonna say. Nope. And I'm not gonna just say what I'm. <laughs> and the reason why I'm so close up is because yesterday, my uh, mom's sister and I, and my mom, went to Dollar General and Randolph, and um, we, bought, we were like there for like two hours buying crap, and I bought like nine toys. I actually bought these chips at Dollar General for like not even like five cents. Five cents a dick. Who <laughs> got the suck of my eye? Chicken pumps on our friends go with tomatoes. Mate, what's the way it Oh no, someone's coming. Break it. When will this torture be over, man? Halfway through the bag. Good thing I ain't breaking out yet. Whenever I eat hot chips, my, my cheeks get really red.
You know what? At the end of the year, I'm going to try and get a bag of Caroline Reaper chips at the First Nations down near the uh, cemetery in Salmanca. I'm going to run down there and get a bag of those at the end of the year for a celebration. Oh, 2019 on YouTube. On December 31st, 2019, I will get pick up a bag of Carolina Reaper chips and eat the full bag on camera with maybe like maybe like two liters of Mountain Dew. Oh yeah, um, I'm gonna give a shout out to Arcade Warrior because a while ago, me and my mom would sit in my dad's room and just binge watch all kinds of Arcade Warrior videos. My mom actually likes watching him. I do too because I love to learn about how arcade games work. Like Monster Jackpot, that one's the best one. I love that one. I played it at Midway Park before and I shoved it up my ass. But the prize I got was a dink. A big ass dink. Colgate Pomo of Canada Incorporated. Down lowly. I'm not daily. I'm not singing Duncan Maddox on camera. Maybe I will. It's a very smooth smoke. Pleasant. <laughs> My ear looks like a dying worm or like a broken down colon. Colon. I'm not wasting any of these. I still have to eat a full bag of jalapeno chips later, too. Well, I don't care. I might do that tomorrow. Well, tomorrow, um, I'm going to be uploading on my new iPad because I'm getting my new iPad tomorrow. There's enriched bottle noodles in here. There's chicken. Oh my. Don't. I want some pink bunny milk. Yay. Dry breadcrumbs. Okay, it's now 8.21, so I've been doing this for about 10 more minutes. I actually would have gotten up right now. <laughs> I would have been getting up from bed right now, but I woke up at like an hour ago. It is dirty. I'm still going to be sitting in a dirty clothes pile right now. Still halfway through the bag and it's almost at 20 minutes. I'm not gonna put God wrong. Well, maybe I'm not sure. Boneless butthole. Did you know my mom actually cut open the pig? No, she didn't. She actually cooked up. She actually cooked a pig rib on National Pig Day. I actually cried because pigs are my favorite animal because they're so cute.
I hear that screech? do this Boneless pizza. Boneless pizza. Ah, I my pizza, Baba. I'm really gonna show you what I'm sitting on right now. I'm sitting on this thing. <laughs> this video is like a YTP Brayden eats diarrhea sticks and a regular video of me dipping ass cheeks into liquid. Look like white stuff. Uh -huh. Next time, if I'm riding a bike, and those two gay homeless hobo guys throw a piece of metal at me. Not the hobo bros. Those guys are awesome. Um, the two hillbillies. I'll go to the warehouse, pick up a piece of metal, and throw it at their baby. Because their baby flipped them off. The mom almost pulled out a shotgun. And that one dude shoved his hand up his ass and pulled it out. And he pulled out a freaking rectum. <laughs> Who ripped your hand? Who rips an erectum by shoving a butthole into their mouth? Last one. I hope you guys enjoyed my YouTube video. If you want some more videos, subscribe to my channel. Um, I will be making another video later on in like maybe like four to five hours from now. And I'll see you guys again next time. Bye. Bill, you stop it.